Hey everyone, I'm Mindy from Cute Girls Hair Styles. You guys have been asking me a ton in my DMs to show you the lake house. We're gonna show you a couple of the rooms that we have fully finished in the lake house. You're going to love them. And thank you to Pottery Barn Teen for sponsoring this video. So the first room we're gonna show you guys today is the movie room. And when we bought the house, the movie room had kind of some swirly patterned carpet in it. It was painted blue. There was like a built-in um, cabinet sitting on one side of the wall that kind of prohibited you from having like good seating with the way that the TV needed to be hung. When we ripped out the cabinet, realized there was no carpet under it. So then we had to replace the carpet and we repainted the entire room. Hey, let's go check it out. I'm so excited to show you guys. Okay, so there's double doors that lead in. And then, ta-da! Look at this, look at the carpet we picked. It's kind of this really cozy, cute plaid. This is the Baldwin couch. I intentionally picked it because it's really cozy, but it's also modular so that it fits any space. Like it just fit this room to a T. Chef's kiss. One of the other things I love the most about the couch, you guys, voila! It's all storage, the whole thing. So we can tuck blankets or extra pillows or things like that that we don't want visible in the room into the couch itself. Okay, another reason that I specifically picked this couch was because it sits low which I really liked because I didn't want it to block the window. Well, you guys know I'm a huge advocate for pet friendly couches. So this one's it's like a really hardy leather. It's gonna hold up well. It's not gonna show a lot of wear and tear or like paw prints immediately if the dogs get their dirty paws on it. We have blankets, like big chunky knit blankets that are really cozy for everybody to use if they need them. We added like decor pieces to the couch and I specifically picked like really fuzzy soft pillows or like this one. It's like the theme of the lake house in general kind of has blues in it. So we found this really beautiful blue that we put on here. These eye-catching decor pieces for me just kind of help finish the space off or you could use them to like update your space if you needed to but it just adds like a lot of warmth, I feel like, to the space and like the finishing touches. You can see we picked a charcoal color to paint the walls. We wanted it dark, it is a movie room. So we have this sea table right here and it's just great for drinks. Fuzzy ottoman that everybody loves. It's like so soft, it's ridiculous. Everyone wants to just lay on the ottoman like this. And then you guys know I have younger kids. So they're still in the like bean bags are everything stage. So we have a couple of these that are just like these giant, super squishy, fluffy chairs. They can pull out and plop down here in the middle of the room if they want to watch TV or when they're watching a movie. Everything is really movable, which is two thumbs up because we can move the ottoman if we need to. We can rearrange the couches. We can move these cute, cozy bean bags if we want to so that everyone has lots of options. We put a frame around our TV so that it looks kind of like intentional artwork as opposed to just a TV. Um, you have this cabinet where we can store all of the electronic equipment that we need. And then just a couple touch like little finishing pieces for the room. Again, the goal is to make it feel really warm, homey, like comfortable, and still like be super user, user friendly and very accessible to anybody. So that's the movie room. The next room I'm gonna show you is what we call the hideaway. So it's kind of at the top of the stairs, there's a landing right here. The previous owner had this um, room as a gym. Since we don't live here full time, we didn't really think like we would be using a gym as much as we would be using like another bedroom. So we wanted to convert it. But it was tricky because this room has a couple windows on the walls and it's a small room. So we wanted to maximize usage. So for tricky rooms like this, you guys know that I have a couple friends that I had helped me design a few spaces that were particularly tricky. I know that Pottery Barn Teen also offers design services. So if you guys need help, they can help you from start to finish on your projects too. And again, before we go in the room, thank you Pottery Barn Teen for sponsoring this video. Before this space was a gym, the floor was like rubber mats and there were giant gym mirrors on the wall. 
and it was just like nothing else was on the walls and there was like gym equipment in here. So now come see what we've done with this room. in I really wanted like a beautiful focal piece so I found this dresser on part of our team I loved loved the texture on the front of this dresser I thought it was so cute and another huge important factor for me was mirrors I wanted mirrors because this is a small space I wanted light bouncing back and for it to feel like it was bigger than it really is so we found these really cool antique frames. These are just frames. And then we took them to a shop and had them put glass into the frames. We have this cute colorful rug. We put this patterned carpet in and I love the texture of both of the rug and the carpet. sitting chair bed is my favorite part so this is the Avalon channel stitch upholstered bed and I felt like it just elevated the whole space because you've got this cute tufted detailing you've got these cute wood legs <laughs> on the bed and it just like makes the whole space magical but this room crazy hard you guys crazy hard so this is a very narrow space and we wanted at least a full-size queen-size bed in here so we could sleep two people the whole bed wraps the corner and so it becomes like kind of this i don't know it almost feels like a loungy couch mixed with a bed everybody loves it and then on top of that it has storage under here so again small space under here you can pull these open and there's these cute little storage drawers so it gives us even extra storage in this room because there's no closet in here so that was a big deal for me along with the dresser so that it gave people somewhere to put their stuff if they were staying in this room. check out the movie room and the hideaway we'll follow up with more lake house tours coming soon um you guys can check out pottery barn team's design services or you can shop my picks down below in the description box and we'll see you guys later bye guys